Hi, hey everybody. Welcome to September. We have three wines. Uh, September was not terribly welcoming to everybody, so hopefully this um, helps turn things around. So, uh, wine number one from Caleri Cantina Turlon or Cantina Turlano, uh, Cuve Turlano. <laughs> what does that mean? That's a lot of turtles. Um, this is a cooperative up in Alto Adige in the Dolomites uh, base of the Alps. And um, even though they're a co-op, they have a long history. Trains are running again. They have a long history. Uh, the co-op was founded in 1893. And that means they buy grapes from lots of small producers. What's interesting, though, about this co-op, it's got a reputation for great quality wines, 70% uh, of which are white. And... Um, uh, they they don't pay by the amount of grapes, but they pay based on the quality of the grapes they get from the local growers, which is uh, which is pretty cool. The white wines really are spectacular, and I wanted to uh, you know and I thought about getting maybe um, a, a, just the regular Pinot Bianco. Uh, if you remember when we had Madalena on from Musella back earlier in the year. Uh, you know, she said, uh, when I asked her about her Pinot Bianco, she's like, uh, I like the Pinot Bianco. I decided to grow Pinot Bianco. I make Pinot Bianco. Uh, it does really well up in northern Italy. And Pinot Bianco, uh, Pinot Bianco is also known as Pinot Blanc. It's the other, other Pinot uh, behind Pinot Noir, Nero, uh, Pinot Gris, Grigio, and uh, Pinot Bianco. So, uh, so this though, this is a cuvee. It's a blend, and uh, you know everyone's into red blends these days. But white blends are pretty cool too, for the same reason, and that is um, the characteristic. You know, really well-made blend. You can pick up a balance in the characteristics of all the different grapes within that wine, um, ideally. And this is sixty percent Pinot Bianco. 30% uh, Chardonnay, 10% uh, Sauvignon Blanc, or Sauvignon as they call it up there. So it's um, it's a really cool blend. It's rich. It's, it's This might be an early leader for Thanksgiving wine uh, because it's got lots of different qualities in it that would pick up uh, lots of different notes in that kind of a meal. And uh, and, and I do believe that, that the Thanksgiving meal traditionally is really principally a white wine uh, meal, if you will. Um, it, it's an interesting microclimate up there. Tolano, the, the town, is um, is in a like, kind of a geographic bowl at the bottom of the mountains there, and that that and, and south facing. So that means that they they get more warmth and more ripeness than most of the surrounding area up that, that far up north. So they do achieve some some more ripeness and richness in, in their fruit. Uh, and this is really a spectacular wine. Uh, I think you will enjoy it. It goes with lots of different things. I mean, I would have this with a white pizza. I would have this with um, Alsatian tart flambe. I would have this with uh, uh, with a, a light white meat, um, like a pork or a veal or something like that. I would have it with uh, certainly with, with a richer chicken dish. Um, cheeses go great with a lot of cheeses. Uh, it's, uh, it, it would also go with lots of Germanic food because this really is a Germanic region. This is that far north in Italy. Uh, you're going to find a lot more blondes and redheads up there than, um, than, than folks look like they're from, from where I'm from. So, uh, anyway, um, enjoy it. This is a, a beautiful wine. If you ever see the, the label for Turlano, uh, grab some of their other single variety whites, even their reds. They do a Lagrain, which is a red grape, uh, which is beautiful, uh, a mountain red. They also do a, uh, a Lagrain Rosé, which I think is, is fantastic too. But um, I think you're really going to enjoy this. Super highly rated. They make an even higher end blend. Uh, if you really like this and you want to splurge, um, the, 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 a similar blend that they do, the uh, Grand Trelana, is, uh, is usually rates around you know 98 to 100 points, which is pretty spectacular. So anyway, there you go. Uh, that's wine one. We're going to go on to... Uh, Wine two in a moment. 